All right, guys. Uh, Sway, he's interviewing Canelo because, you know, Canelo got a fight coming up with uh, Edgar Belanga. And Crawford came up like it always does. Even after Crawford fought Israel Madrimov and whatever what, what, what I just seen and what a lot of the boxing boxing community just seen, this question still comes up. To me, it's crazy, but it is. And I'm going to say this. Even before the Israel Majamal fight, I said it's a stupid fight. I said Terrence Crawford. I gave you a reason. I said Terrence Crawford's too small. He'll get beat. Knocked out. Things like that. So anytime you hear somebody say, Terrence Crawford, you'll hear, um, what's the boots fight come up? And they'll say, oh, he don't need to do that. He don't need to fight that. It's because there's a reason why they do that. Because those particular fans, you don't work for Crawford. They not He's not paying you. You're a boxing fan like I am. Don't you want to see the fighter fight the best people? He ain't paying your bills. He ain't, he ain't doing none of that stuff. You ain't getting no money from this guy. He only got a couple of fights left in his body. And you hear him say, I want to see Crawford get a big bag. What you care about him getting back? He ain't giving it to you. Anyway, we'll get back to that. Let, let's take a listen to this. Let's take a listen. We'll come back to Edgar, right? A lot of people are, are feeling like this isn't the best fight mm -hmm. that could have been made, right? Folks wanted, obviously, everybody wants to fight Benavides. Mm -hmm. And now there's conversation about Crawford. Crawford saying he wanted to fight you. Mm -hmm. um, everybody. Everybody wants to fight you. Yeah. <laughs> now, I saw at the end of the Crawford fight, the. Uh, how they call him, the Excellency, yeah, mm -hmm. uh, Turkey, his, ex his Excellency. His, his Excellency um, the, the Sheik said that he would be willing to pay whatever you want to yeah. fight Crawford. Fine. Yeah. If he's willing to pay whatever I want. <laughs> <laughs> that yeah, that'll work. Yeah, so if I he, mean. <laughs> yeah, you're in. So if, yeah. if the numbers were right with Crawford, you'll do it. Why not? Why not? Mm -hmm. I think Crawford don't get me wrong. He's a great fighter, mm -hmm. but uh, for me, in my weight class, it's a it's an easy fight mm -hmm. for me. Canelo knows it's an easy fight. <coughs> now he ain't gonna say, "Oh, I take fifty million. He gonna he gonna want he gonna want a number." Y'all talking this Crawford talk? I want a number. Y'all talking this Benavidez fight? I want a bigger number. His number's bigger for Benavidez because that's more of a challenge, more of a risk. But he's willing to fight a guy that was essentially three weight classes below him. Now it's two because he just fought at 154, Terrence Crawford. But he complained that Benavidez was too big. And he said, Benavidez, he's like a, he wants to, he's bigger. You know, he wants to rehydrate. He's like two divisions higher. But he don't want to fight that. He don't, he don't want to take that chance. It's too risky. He calling the shots now, Canelo. Y'all want me to pay? Y'all y'all want me to pay? Excuse me. Y'all want me to play? Y'all need to pay. He knows it. Terrence Crawford's easy work now. He got confirmation over la last week. That's easy work. Give me my money, Turkey. You see money. <laughs> so if the money is right, um, I mean, because, you know, I don't like to fight guys like, like Crawford because he move a lot and the fight is not that great. Mm -hmm. I, I saw Crawford the last uh, uh, the last fight and he don't, he don't move uh, uh, that much now. So, mm -hmm. yeah, if the money is right, I'm, I mean, why not? How do you think he did at, uh, at that weight? At one... They said, you know, like Crawford move around. He like fighting guys that's kind of Benavidez is like that. He don't move around that much. He coming to you. Benavides want that action. Benavides was in his weight class. This is a guy Canelo don't want to fight. The guy that's even in his weight class, he's willing to fight guys that are smaller than him. Y'all remember when he fought Amir Khan? You either you either not you either smaller than him, 
or something. You didn't have. You got a lot of wear and tear on you. The man fought uh, Jamel Charlo and said, "I love boxing. Boxing is my life." You going to fight Benavidez? No, no. I need 200, 300, 400 million. Uh, he didn't say 400 million, but he named some crazy price. That's how you get out of fights when you start naming these high pr prices. But I guarantee that price will come down a little bit for that Crawford fight. At 154, how do you think Crawford did? You know, they 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 are uh, weight class for a reason. That's and right. He, you need to ask him. It's, it's, it's different. Mm -hmm. I know in his mind he thinks he can do whatever he wants because he, he's a very talented mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. fighter. He, he He's a very good fighter. I like how he fights. But uh, that's why there are uh, uh, weight classes. Yeah. And, yeah. and he, 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 know, he knows now. He knows, he knows now. now. You think he felt that? Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh Crawford does know. I don't care what you believe you can do. I believe I can fly. Can I fly? When you get older, you believe you can still do stuff until you get out there and try to do it and you get hurt. Tear something. Your injuries last longer. Somebody made a comment and said, if you believe it, you can do anything. All you got to do is your mind. You got to believe. No, your body go with it. If Terrence Crawford think he can be heavyweight champion of the world, can he be heavyweight because he believes it? Come on, man. Let's, talk. Let's make this make sense. Crawford knows there's weight class for a reason, and you can tell when they brought up Canelo after he fought Israel Majumov that his, his tone changed. Terrence Crawford got a high boxing IQ. You don't think he realizes it is that, that 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 might not be a good idea now after fighting Madrimov? Yeah, he beat him. But that's only 154. We talking bypassing 160 to 168. Canelo didn't even move like that. Canelo, when he moved up, he settled in the weight class, stayed there. Moved up, settled in the weight class, moved up, settled in. You, you want Crawford just to just jump. Oh, he got skills. What's the point of having skills if you ain't moving around boxing like Canelo just said and you ain't got no power on your punches no more? Being a VDS went up to 175 and that power is gone. Benavidez hit that man a thousand times. Didn't even hurt him. Now, I think Canelo, excuse me, I think Crawford hurt Madrimov some in his last fight. Not to the point where he's about to fall down, but he got his attention. They keep talking about this dang on Canelo. That's why he's laughing and smiling. He's like, well, these guys are idiots. They keep asking about this Terrence Crawford fight. That's why when they ask about Benavides, Canelo gets upset. Because he don't want that fight. When they talk about Cane uh, Crawford, he's grinning. He's sitting there, Sway don't know. He, he had the nerve to ask that question. In my class, it's, a, it's an easy fight. Mm -hmm. Hold on, when they Everybody wants to fight you. Yeah. Now, you, see, you see that green he got? I saw at the end of the Crawford fight the uh, how they call him the excellency. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, Turkey. His, ex his excellency. His, his excellency um, the, the sheik said that he would be willing to pay whatever you want to yeah. fight Crawford. Fine. Yeah. If he's willing to pay whatever I want. <laughs> <Comes out. laughs> yeah, that'll work. Dude is grinning, man. Mm -hmm. That could have been made, right? Folks wanted, obviously, everybody wants to fight Benavides. Mm -hmm. And now there's conversation about Crawford. Crawford saying he wanted to fight you. Mm -hmm. um, everybody. Yeah. Everybody. He's not, man, when he, it, that was a point where they they bringing up Benavides, dude. Tanello, he's sick of it. It pisses him off. They talk Crawford, he's, oh, pay the money. He don't like fighting them. And then he said he didn't really didn't not in this interview. Say he's too small. 
You don't want to be a bully. I don't care how much you love Crawford. They asked Timothy Bradley sitting in his car, asked him the same question. He don't even believe Crawford going to be. He, he want to see it. Why would you want your guy to fight his career, get to the end, and all you're going to remember is him getting knocked out by Canelo? It's going to erase everything. Look at Errol Spence Jr. Beating everybody. Body snatcher. Ice belt. What do you call it? Uh, this is, uh, uh, man, he had a whole lot of uh, sands that he had. Strap season. Man down, hands down. Now when you hear Errol Spence, or you even think of him, all you can think about is that ass whooping he took from Terrence Crawford. I like Errol Spence. It's going to be the same thing with, with Crawford. He's going to have all these accolades from what he done. And then you're going to remember him. His last, his going away party is getting dominated and knocked out. That's what I think going to happen. Now, y'all might think different. This is just my opinion on, the, on, on, on this fight. I don't think it's going to happen. I think Crawford realizes that, that, that that's a task that's too, is, is too steep. You know, he's going to use his boxing IQ and say, nah, and he'll stay at the weight class he's at. He's at. All right, guys, I just wanted to show this. They they still uh, entertaining this, even after what they've seen this past weekend. For what reason? I don't know. But I don't think Terrence Crawford's going to entertain that fight no more. That's just me personally. He got, he got other fish to, that need to be fried. Comment, rate, subscribe, subscribe, like. It's your boy.